There has never been a better time to be informed about the importance of water conservation. Today, the students at Environmental Charter High School are learning all about rainwater harvesting. I feel right now we are in a drought and we are in a recession. And right now more than ever we need to be more conscious um, about our water use and where it's going and where it's coming from. Rainwater harvesting is, is, is a valuable practice and, and, uh, uh, in order to supplement our own water supply and increase water awareness. The water harvesting process is very simple. First, the water falls on the rooftop of the house, then collected through the gutters and directed to the downspot and into the barrel. Each barrel holds about 55 gallons of water and you can have as many barrels as you would like. It just goes in there and the water just funnels right down in there. There's no con physical connection between the barrel and the downspout. The reason for rainwater catchment simply is to uh, take advantage of the rainfall on uh, your private property. I think it's one of the most efficient, effective, simple ways to make sure that you're being part of the, the solution instead of part of the problem. Because all it is is an old barrel um, using a spout that you already have and making sure that the water is just out there instead of paying a huge water bill. In a few easy steps, we can see how to create a rainwater harvesting barrel from inexpensive and readily available material. Downspout. We're going to move this downspout up to this location or so, and it's going to point directly into the hole that we're going to make right here. So we're just tracing the top of this so that we know where to cut the hole. Water harvesting is, is important to me because we live in a region of the world where water is a scarce resource. We need to conserve as much as we can and we're using the water to its full potential and as efficient as possible. Most people don't realize that Los Angeles is technically a coastal desert and therefore uh, most of the water that we use here in Southern California has to be imported from Northern California and the Colorado River. You're saving money, you're saving um, resources and you're saving um, you're actually saving energy because it takes a lot of energy for water to be pumped up and when we run our faucets, when we pump water up from aqueducts, we're, we're wasting all this energy. Um, so it's a good way to be really conscious and connected to the planet.